I am Anil Kumar sharing with you test questions based on logarithmic functions. Here are two very interesting questions. The very first one is which expression has a larger value? Justify your answer. Log to the base 2 of 36 or log to the base 3 of 80. Right? You can always pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. Question number 2 is Determine the value of log to the base x of 27 minus log to the base x of 3 equals 2. 2 log y. Value of, uh, actually I should have written y, so which is missing. Value of y, right? We need to find what y is, right? Okay. So these are the two questions for you. You can always pause the video answer and then look into my suggestions. The very first one. Let's look into what is log to the base 3 of 80, right? So we could approximate this as log to the base 3 of 81, which is equals to log to the base 3 of 3 to the power of 4. So that gives you 4, correct? Approximately, right? So a bit lesser, but almost. Perfect. On the other hand, we have log to the base 2 of we can approximate this. This is more than 32, right? 36 is more than 32. So, so even if I write this as 32, right? That means log to the base 2 of 2 to the power of 5. So this is actually around 5, correct? So, so what we see here is that this value is less than 4. And this value here is greater than 5. So now which expression has a larger value? Clearly this expression has a larger value. Clear? So we know that log to the base 2 of 36 is greater than log to the base 3 of 80. Is that clear to you? So that is how we are going to get our result. Perfect. So by simple approximation we get fairly good result. Now the second question is a logarithmic equation. What you need to remember is the laws of logarithms. When it is negative, then you could divide, right? So we have log to the base x of 27 minus log to the base x of 3 equals 2, 2 times log to the base x of y. So on the left side, you could write this as log to the base x of 27 over 3, right? On the right side, you could write this as log to the base x of y squared using the power rule. So, so the left side now becomes log to the base x of 27 divided by 3 is 9. And on the right side, we have log to the base x of y squared. Now, since the bases are same, we could write 9 as equals to y squared. Correct? Now, as far as y is concerned, we know y has to be greater than 0. Otherwise, log is not defined. So now, when from here, what is y equals to? y equals to square root of 9, and we are only going to take positive value. So positive 3 is going to be our answer. So we get our answer, which is y equals to 3. Is that clear to you? So that is how we are going to solve this logarithmic equation. So I hope both the questions are absolutely clear. Now in the test paper on functions, where we distribute different questions, these could be probable questions on logarithms. Thanks for watching and all the best.